Hola, como estas, YouTube? I, uh, sorry that I was kind of not around for a little bit. I've been doing a lot of stuff. Um, one of the things that I happened to do was I finished my horns. Sorry that I didn't get to show you guys the paint job, but I promise there'll be many, many more where that came from. I mean, not horns per se, but probably some type of other artistic dealie will be definitely on this channel, and I'll show you guys how I do it. Um, these are the horns from before. These are the uh, horns for my cousin. I keep saying customer, but it's it's my cousin. These are his his character's horn. It's one horn with the damage and another horn that's been slashed. So if you look at that, these guys are it's decent weight, decent, you know. The tighter you tie these bad boys, the harder they are to wiggle too. So if I really wanted to tie it, you know, like it's supposed to be, that's hardly going anywhere. So, and these are super lightweight, really, really, really cool. Um, and be, having a soft backing means that you can put them anywhere. Uh, when you pack them away, this is pretty much how you just wrap it and put them somewhere. It's also pretty neat. Like, I think that could be a device or something like that later, right? I don't know. Like somebody's symbol. The Broken Horn Tribe. I don't know. Uh, but these are the big daddies. These are the horns that you guys have seen the process of how I make them. Everything except for the uh, the paint job. And I, I apologize about that. But trust me, I will be getting them uh, another paint job soon. So you guys can check it out. I think I uh, did okay on them. Obviously, as an artist, I think I did crappy. Everybody else seems to like them. You guys let me know what you think. So this is this is the paint job. These are, again, the same thing that we made. Uh, that The videos that we were showing, this is, this is it. I didn't remake or do anything else. Uh, the one thing I really liked about using the blue foam is because the Daptic, when it hardened, it cured. And uh, when it cures, it gets this rubbery kind of texture, right? So when you paint over that, it kind of shows through as uh, lines. And uh, if anybody knows anything about bones or horns and stuff like that, there's there's the lines of growth. I thought that was uh, a neat mistaking, you know, bonus in my in my opinion. And it came out to be a bonus after everything was said and done. It was just like, hey, that's not bad. I'll keep it. Uh, another thing is. Uh, they're a lot heavier than the other ones, and they're a lot bigger. But I'm a big guy, so I hope that they look proportionate. Uh, but yeah, you guys just let me know what you think. Um, and I hope to see you at 7th Kingdom IGE uh, on September. It's uh, September 6th through the 8th. You guys should definitely come out. Have a good one.